A few years back, I was honored to dance in a benefit called Dance with the Pittsburgh Celebrities. Here I am with Katie Sports anchor Bob Pompieni. I quickly learned how hard it is, so difficult. If you watch any dance competition on TV, you know the pros make it look so easy. Well, this year, it's Katie Kia's Julie Grant's turn on the dance floor, and she is here with her dance partner and owner of Demidov Dance Studio, Dimitri Demidov, and show director and owner of Integral Ballroom, Luann O'Brien. Good morning to all of you. Good morning, Good morning. Good morning. This is such an exciting time. I mean, Julie, you have to be just so thrilled. It's so neat to learn something dance floor. Yes, it's a blast. It's so much fun. I feel so grateful to be doing this. I, I just think it, it it's just such a wonderful opportunity. It's for such a great cause and Demetri's just the best partner I could have ever oh, had. Thank you. <laughs> well, you are. It's true. <laughs> Luann, tell us about Dance with the Pittsburgh Celebrities. It is such a fun event and you have put on numerous Yes, we're up to 17 completed, two more planned for this year, wow. including the one in, in April. And so a lot of money has gone towards charities almost a million dollars has gone yes. towards charities yes. yes and so this year who is the big uh, charitable group that's receiving well Cardinal World North Catholic High School which is located in the Cranberry area it's um, the events going to benefit their tuition assistance fund that's yes. great and so how many couples do you have mm. eight couples eight couples and so all trying for that <laughs> and so the way that it is, it, you have a professional mm -hmm. and, sorry, Julie, an amateur. No, no offense taken. No, I, I, I am. Yeah, I was offense, once in your pro. position. <laughs> He's the pro. She's the pro. <laughs> they are the pro. They are phenomenal. Just, you know this. You've, you've done it before. Yes. Well, so tell us how it works. How do you pair them up um, and, and how does the competition work? Well, we have the charity contact different celebrities. And then the celebrities are assigned a partner based on location, scheduling, mm -hmm. height sometimes. <laughs> uh, there's a big difference between Dimitri and I. So <laughs> I tend to go with the guys that are more my height. And mm -hmm. so, and that's the way we do it. And we practice. Um, they're guaranteed one lesson a week. Then they have coaching by the pros. Because some of them have dance partners who are just really good ballroom dance dancers who are not really instructors. Mm -hmm. But uh, then we coach them. Yep. Mm -hmm. And so, Dimitri, tell me what it's like. I mean, you you have such a great history working with some professional dancers. So what's the difference in working with professional dancers and then starting from scratch? Although, Julie, I know you were a cheerleader, so you have some moves down. But, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. but, but how, how does that work? What's the difference there? Uh, it's just the... With professionals, you don't need to explain so much. So professionals know what to do, and they just show up and just dance and then I'm sure you need to explain a little bit more to find the words how to explain maybe create some images so they can see and then um, and it's just the practicing and practicing and practicing with them to show them how to do it correctly and and just have fun with them so they feel that it's something fun to do or, yeah is that what you do at your studio do you work more with uh, professionals or people that are interested in dance uh people who are interested in dance yeah and julie what has it been like i know that you mm -hmm. suffered an injury yes mid, <laughs> mid -pra like during your practicing uh, so uh so how how has it been for you right so i've been out of commission for about four weeks yep. yes four weeks I, I had to rest um and, and this is just the truth. I was so excited to do this competition, so grateful they asked me. And I, I told Dimitri on our first practice, please challenge me. I don't want easy moves because people yeah. are spending their hard-earned money. Right. We right. want to put on a great show for them. So I told her, let's put on a fabulous yeah. dance, give people their money's worth. And I overdid the exercising to get in shape for because I was so out of shape <laughs> and just huffing yeah. and puffing, trying to get through the dance. It's and hard. I was, right, it really is. So I was at home doing lunges and I, I I have what's called a plantar plate sprain, kind of middle toes. And so and really the only way to heal that is just to rest it and to stay off it. So I mentally practiced just watching him. We, we were just kidding around yeah. about it. You know, like he would dance, I would watch, just try to learn the steps in my head. So we're kind of rushing yeah. now at the last minute. Yeah, to... sometimes I even like, stop, <laughs> Julie, it's okay, it's okay. Don't, it's okay, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. No, be fine. no, let's do more, let's do more. Let's, I'm like, it's okay. Well, good, I can't wait yeah. to see it. And stay with us, because we're going to take a quick break. And when we come back, we are going to get a performance from Julie and Dimitri in our preview of next Saturday's big Dance with Pittsburgh Celebrities event. Stay with us.